so with, with you, uh, when I'm uh, looking at my, my uh, the other screen, I don't see the, the chat, so maybe someone can tell me. Uh, it's fine, don't worry about it, and we are live. So hi again, everyone. Uh, hi, Tony, how are you doing? Uh, really well, and you? I am doing fantastically, as fantastically as I can be doing, uh, having to put out fire in the background during the MaxConf. <laughs> but I'm doing great. Cool. All right, let me just try to set up everything so that I can show the questions and all this. Do you mind if I read you the question? It might be a little more interactive, and this way you can focus on either presenting yes, yes, stuff on your end. Yes, yes. Uh, tell me uh, what are the questions and uh, what... Uh... What, what to do, and I will, uh, I will do that. OK, great. So what uh, what I'll do, uh, I'll invite people to go to the panel and ask questions, because it was a very interesting talk. And I'm sure you have plenty of questions, but I only see one right now. Do we have people on the blue button? Yes, we do have people joining right now. Um, so uh, reading the first question then, so what's the main motivation for this new package? I used to use org Hugo and use GitHub Actions to build a blog. So can you go in a little bit of details on this? Yes, OK, so the, the, um, the, uh, the main goal, um, I, uh, I didn't want to, uh, to have, so I, I will uh, push that uh, here. So my goal was to. Uh, to not have to rely on uh, another static site uh, ge uh, generator to uh, produce my website. So if you if you use a uh, Hugo, that means that uh, you take uh, you, uh, so this is uh, the, um, the website that we've seen uh, that uh, in, in the in the talk. This one, and I didn't want to to have to uh, to use a piece of software in Emacs that translate to some other files to be fed to another statistic generator because uh, this way I have two uh, two uh, two things to understand. I have to understand uh, how that software translates my uh, my uh, files into the other files, and then I have to understand how Hugo uh, works. So if I want to to change something, I need to understand Hugo. So so at some point, uh, I need to, to work uh, with uh, Hugo. So if I need to work with Hugo, I, maybe I can work with it uh, uh, directly. And I wanted also something that was uh, um, a pu a purely uh, Emacs uh, centric and, uh, and working, uh, working on it, I, I, uh, I found out about uh, that solution. And I, want, I, I wanted also something that uh, um, that we have only one one file that uh, that have all the entries and uh, and when when I thought about that finally I find the way that uh, maybe we can just use one or uh, entry to uh, to pass it uh, to pass it uh, the information of uh, of uh, the website so uh, and and if you look uh, if if you just try to work with uh, Gatsby, Hugo, or all those uh, websites. Uh, when you, you start, you don't learn 10, 20, 30, 5, then for, uh, for uh, uh, hundreds of, of uh, dependencies to, to, to do. Just, uh, just to me, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a small guy, and I just want to have some document, documentation on the, the a website like uh, this one, it just it, it, it shouldn't need that much of uh, dependency. And if you look uh, at the website, if you want to act on something, you need uh, a lot of uh, to, to, to understand how the config files work. So you need to, how does it work, this config file? But I want, it's always happened that you want to add one thing, and to add that thing, what do you have to do? You have to. Uh, you you can't because it's not offered. But by the uh, by the configuration file, with that solution that uh, I I built for me first, uh, I don't care uh, if I need something else. I I just have to go in uh, that file, and it, it shouldn't be. A, it, it doesn't need to be that file because as as I am in Emacs, if the render functions are 
already evaluated, they exist and I can use it, but I just have to change that file. So if I want something more, uh, I just, I, I go there. Let's say so. Uh, does it answer the question or I, I continue to, to, to show something? Uh, it, it's up to you. I think you are answering the question. I think you veered off a little bit from just why not you go, but then you kind of read yes. part of your presentation to justify <laughs> why you had to okay. roll your own system. But, but, uh, but stop me if, if I go, because I, I used to, to, to want to show more things that, uh, sure. that uh, what there is in the question. So. Yeah, but that's, that's fine. Just for people who do not know, we tend to restrict speakers when they submit a presentation. We tell them, oh, you can do a, a flash talk in 10 minutes or a bit of a longer talk in 20 minutes or 40 minutes. And usually, because we have a lot of speakers, we have to kind of coerce people into going to shorter formats. And sometimes it's uh, a lot about killing your darlings. Uh, but just to reassure you, we're just about to go on a launch break in about 10 minutes. So you've got the full 10 minutes to use however you want. But I'll just tell you, you have a lot of questions. So you might want to perhaps move on to the next one as soon as you can. Yes, OK, so tell me the next one. And um, if oh. people um, want to, 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 to stay more, I can also uh, stay more. So. But, right. Uh, I, I understand if people need to go to, to lunch, they can, but people that want to stay, if it's possible, I'm here to answer uh, any uh, question. Splendid. All right. So moving on to the next question. Is it possible to include uh, the include org tag to add content from other files? Are you, do you see what I'm talking about? Uh, yes. So uh, it's it's not included. So you, uh, the, the idea is, is it was really to not uh, to have only one file uh, and have uh, no option. So if 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 you look at uh, let's go into uh, so the answer is no. But if you want, you you can write the code that uh, that uh, do it. But let's just go into uh, one dot l. So uh, that size. So uh, this is the file uh, where you have uh, ev uh, everything, uh, and uh, there is only uh, two uh, dependencies. Maybe we can see that at the top. So uh, which are uh, HTML and the uh, Jack, and the other are Ogmod. So for me, they are, they are not dependencies because they come with uh, with uh, Emacs. But the question is, uh, can I add uh, other things? If you look at uh, at that, you don't if you, you don't uh, see the orange color which are viable. It's because uh, I didn't want uh, any configuration nor option. So there's no, uh, uh, if, if you think about, uh, you, you, you are used to use uh, org export uh, normally and to use all the options that are possible on all the things, uh, they are not uh, included. You can, you can uh, add them because uh, when, when uh, you are in one, but uh, so, when you are in a render function, so this is a render function that I showed in the thing, you have a page tree, so you have the information, but in in, uh, in the global, I think, so yes, uh, in global, uh, you can pass anything uh, you want, and if you want, you can pass the, the parser tree of the whole file. So if you pass the parse tree of the whole files, what you can do is that you can uh, you can get it uh, there. So uh, this, I don't have it right now, but you 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 might uh, have your uh, include uh, include stuff, and you get it with uh, an odd property uh, that uh, that target uh, something in the global uh, global variable. So if we look just to be short, but those three uh, uh, part. The first one is page three, so it zips the page that you are on the read. Pages are a list of all the pages. And global is uh, something that you can set and be set once, and uh, you have uh, the uh, the all uh, the whole uh, part tree. So anything that you add in your uh, org files uh, could be uh, could go in global if you want, but it's not included. All right. Yeah. I, I think that's also answering the question: Can this generate a single file from different sources like blog.org, videos.org? I think you've just answered this, right? Yes, I think yes. Right. OK, so moving on to the other question. Do you have pre-made templates already along with the one that EL package? Uh, so uh, yes and no. So the answer is um, if uh, we go to um, one 
but end so this uh, this file so the first are uh, blah 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 so uh, how it works so okay so uh, you have the org uh, the one uh, dash ox which is the uh, what can translate the uh, org parse tree into uh, html so this is for the content of uh, each page so this is uh, useful then you, uh, we have a bunch of uh, functions that uh, that uh, help to render uh, the function uh, the, the uh, each uh, pages and uh, you you have a bunch of uh, here uh, everything that starts with dash default is a render function so there is no template but uh, each page uh, that uh, if you want uh, to, um, so th uh, that one uh, the home you can use uh, one uh, default home so if you want to list the page you have uh, that one for a page with uh, no uh, table of content you, you use that uh, that thing and if you go back to be short if we uh, we go uh, there i put uh, this like that and uh, so this that we uh, we see uh, here is uh, the first headline of uh, one.org uh, by the way it don't have to be uh, it doesn't have to be called the uh, one.org it's just uh, as you want but maybe we can call it um, so default. What was the other one? That uh, default with sidebar. Or uh, is default with sidebar or default? Yes, uh, with sidebar. Sidebar. Uh, if it works correctly. Okay. So. Uh, okay. So. I don't know why the CSS is not. Uh, uh, working correctly, so it's, it's okay. Good. It wouldn't be a it wouldn't be a live demo without problems occurring at some point. <laughs> okay, but uh, so maybe uh, we can use uh, this one talk or uh, with talk. So we are going to use this one with talk. Uh, this one, but maybe better in uh, the full uh, this one that has uh, something. So. We uh, build it again, and now uh, up. Come on, we have it, and we have the uh, sorry. So, if we have just uh, default, we rebuild, and now this is the the default uh, layout that is. If we do with uh, with uh, table of content. Uh, you have it, you have the default uh, content. So how to, to change uh, and um, it's, it's, they are not template. They are render functions that take uh, your, your, uh, your uh, page as a, a tree uh, and render HTML string. So you can uh, build any function that you want. So the, uh, yes, I think that answers the question. There is no template like in uh, other uh, system. Sure, that makes sense. Uh, we have two more questions, and then we'll need to go on a lunch break. I don't see anyone join the room. Uh, remember, uh, Tony has said that he would be willing to answer more questions during the lunch break, perhaps because it's not lunch break for you. Are you in Europe right now? Yes. So that's why for us, uh, also for yes, me, it's yes. very dark. But uh, it's not lunch break for us. It's going to be dinner break too, actually. <laughs> yes, it's uh, uh, exactly. So I just uh, I'm, I'm okay. Right. Okay. So moving on to uh, one of the last two questions. What additional features are there that you would like to add to one that el in the future? Yes, there's only one, which is a full text uh, search uh, done in a simple way. So uh, I don't mean what simple way uh, means, but when I see something complicated, it doesn't enter in one dot L uh, to me. So, uh, but but uh, really, if if you see that, I would like to have some uh, some way. So this is the, the 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 documentation, and I would like to have some way to just have another function, because we we are not talking about uh, those websites uh, on the one dot L. It's not made for. Uh, for a big company or uh, of your things, it's just for a random guy that have a, a blog or a few blogs. And uh, if you are a, a great blogger, maybe you are going to write uh, uh, 
100 or uh, two, three or three, uh, 300 pages in, uh, in, in many years. So the, this center in, the, in, the, in that category, so it's small. So I think it can, uh, we, we could uh, find a way to make a, a, a full text search uh, that is simple and don't need to, uh, to go with, uh, with solution like uh, Algolia that is uh, that works super fine but this is something that uh, i don't control and uh, and uh, i have to give them the data and i'm not against that but it's just that uh, i think with a bit of work we uh, something can be done with a full excel but uh, this is the only uh, only thing that i would like to to add clear very clear answer uh, next question. Uh, can you create nav bars on a website and fancy things like carousels using one that yell? Now, carousel is just, uh, I think, um, a fancy way to display pictures. And please correct me, whoever asked this, the, this question. Otherwise, I see you taking notes for the answers. Thank you very much. But if you could specify maybe carousel so that Tony and I may get a better idea. But still, first part of the question, can you create nav bars on a website? Yes. So if... if uh, um, uh, for instance, you see there. To me, it's, it's not a it's a navbar, so you 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 yep. you, you, you already uh, have it, and uh, I didn't show that in the um, in the talk. But uh, the, the the CSS for the default uh, function that works is a uh, responsive. So you you uh, out of the box, if you are uh, using something, you you will have uh, a nav bar done for you with uh, all the pages that you have. So if we go to uh, install, we have we have that, and if we uh, we no longer is, we have uh, that uh, that uh, that sidebar uh, at uh, there, and how it's done. So uh, the same way, I like simple fields that are flexible and i didn't want configuration because if you want to write the code to change something you just have to write code so any function render function is your so you can do whatever you want and if you enter the html that you want to, uh, to render so let's see how do we uh, do uh, how do we get that uh, that uh, navigation bar that uh, we have when uh, we, we do that so this is a css stuff but when we click, uh, this is a uh, GS stuff that, uh, so let's go into one.l. And maybe this is a sidebar. Why is that function? Because, OK, so when uh, that function, so one default sidebar is one that is used to, uh, to, to, to do uh, some of the things. At some point, what we return is a uh, drag HTML that uh, take a data structure and return uh, a string. So this is your HTML. So you can see at the top, you have, uh, you have the end, then you, you have uh, the body. And if we go at the end, we can add a script, uh, script thing. So what we've seen with the sidebar, it's just uh, that much line of JavaScript. So this is the, this is, uh, the, the only JavaScript that uh, there is to, uh, to get uh, to get what we have, uh, what we have uh, here when we do, uh, we do that. So oh. you, 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 you can, uh, you can add uh, whatever you want. It's code, and you're, uh, you're uh, the master of uh, that code. Splendid, great. Um, so to specify the carousel stuff that we mentioned before, it's uh, pictures rolling or sliding from one to the other. Uh, to the other, it's kind of like having a gallery. Uh, imagine a fancy dynamic gallery where you can scroll pictures. Do you see what I'm talking yes. about? Yes. So it that things would, would just be, I think, uh, some uh, JavaScript uh, added somewhere, and I can show yep. you another, another website. So, for instance, if we go, because with uh, there are not all uh, the, the the data of the website are not all public, but the website they are. So, for instance, uh, mini buffer. It's not a carousel, but mm -hmm. at, the, at the home page, uh, we can do whatever we want. Uh, still, those pages, still, this is only one file that uh, for uh, each page. So if we click, we, we can get uh, those things. It's just that when we, uh, for the home page, for instance, when we go back on uh, that home page, we have the list at that point. So let's go back to. Uh, 
uh, to that function that uh, so not that one maybe the one one default it's uh, better because uh, that one is simple so the, almost nothing uh, happened we have the list of the pages so I can do whatever I want with uh, with uh, that list I, I can uh, I can uh, loop uh, over and we can see uh, that one that that uh, default home list of pages so that list of the pages and we see where is the list Okay, so uh, this is a, here we have a function that uh, just uh, we want the pages, but I think uh, we uh, but the home page, and uh, we uh, we have that list, and then uh, here we do uh, we do that, and uh, we we uh, we get uh, we get something uh, listed, but then. As you control everything that you do, you can pass uh, any uh, any any um, uh, CSS class that uh, you want to do uh, to do those things. So, for instance, that div add the, the class uh, either. So, yes, you can do. Uh, I don't remember the question, but I think I was answering uh, the right one. No, no, you you were answering it. It was about carousels and about having fancy display for. Uh, image galleries, and I think you've answered. Basically, you just put your JavaScript, you embed it in the, inside the code. Exactly. Uh, so, other question: Would there be an automated way to convert an existing HTML document into a Jack HTML form? Okay, so that one uh, I don't have uh, one. It's uh, another topics, but maybe there are some uh, kind of solutions because. Some people that know uh, that are used to uh, to Lisp, uh, or common Lisp or Clojure or other uh, Jack dash HTML uh, that that uh, function is is, uh, is something classic, but I didn't find so I wrote it because I didn't find it uh, um, already done the way I want for um, for um, uh, sorry for uh, Emacs. And uh, this is something from uh, eCup closure. So uh, really, uh, I take uh, it's not that I take my impression. It's just that when you have something that exists, uh, you 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 uh, you look at uh, how it's done. So you have a uh, eCup for closure uh, does uh, does the same thing that HTML. It's more that I do uh, uh, Jack uh, Jack HTML do uh, what uh, eCup uh, does, but uh, maybe the the do it a, a better way. So uh, I think maybe uh, in that community uh, it might already exist something that go from uh, that go from HTML to uh, to uh, to Jack, uh, and, and so you you can see uh, here. It, it, is it uh, big enough? I will make it uh, big enough. So if you see uh, enough, thing, don't worry. so you, you have the hash, uh, HTML, and, and you see uh, those things. There are things that uh, I, I couldn't do, for instance, for the ID. I couldn't use the uh, hash in the name of uh, of um, of uh, how do we name that of keywords because uh, it's it's uh, it's used for something else uh, in uh, in uh, in Max Lisp. Uh, so I use uh, anyway. So you see that you have uh, that things, but uh, in, in in Emacs we don't uh, in Max Lisp we don't have the map. Uh, with that syntax, we, we have a hash map, but they are not with uh, that syntax, and I wanted uh, that syntax, so we uh, we um, we have um, uh, we use only list, and uh, here we uh, we have uh, an array with a uh, hash map. So um, let me just say: so the question was, uh, does it exist uh, something? Uh, I think uh, not, but uh, it could be built or maybe exist for uh, for uh, ECAPS. Yeah, you are interested. Okay, great. I think that answers the question perfectly. And our final question: Does this or you use any other Emacs packages for your packages slash website example or publish? Like uh, rephrasing the question: Do you use it for your own personal usage, or do you interact with other packages? I'm not sure I understand the question. Uh, can, can you uh, please repeat uh, the question? Yes, I will reread it as it is written, and I will okay, leave you yes. interpret it however you want. Thank you. <laughs> Does this or you use any other Emacs packages for your package 
slash website like org publish uh, no 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 i i don't use uh, nothing i i just uh uh accept dependency of uh, one.l so if we uh so we are in one.l and we go at the top and we see that uh, those are uh, the dependencies i i use uh, nothing so what i do is that I publish, uh, I uh, just uh, generate the public uh, directory. So if we go to, to public, uh, this one, no, I don't want this one. I want to go uh, one.org, so the, the website of the, the video. And if we see uh, here, everything is rendered in the public. So uh, uh, any uh, any services are, uh, or if you, uh, or you, um, you use your own, um, uh, server and you save those files you have uh, your website so i i don't use anything else i, I just uh, git push and uh, i'm using the uh, netly fly as a as a as a service to uh, to run the, to save my files but you, you can use uh, anything you want because your website is really what is uh, into a uh, public so this is an, another uh, it's, it's not the concern of uh, one that uh, l on the to answer i'm not i'm not using a uh, org publish cool great well thank you I, I think the question was also about other things but uh, uh i think if the person wants a more clear answer to their question uh feel free to clarify the question and tony might be able to answer it later on all right tony i think that's all the question we had thank you so much for taking the time not only to present at imax Kant, but also for answering all the questions people had uh, thank you uh, to uh, everybody uh, participating, organizing, and uh, thank you for all uh, those uh, questions. And uh, you can uh, send me any uh, any uh, emails if you have a question on the uh, open uh, issues. If uh, it's not working uh, the way it should work uh, for you, uh, please send me uh, those things. Thank you, uh, everybody. Yeah. Splendid, thank you. And before, so right now we're going to go on a lunch break. We'll be back in about 40 minutes for uh, the talk called Emacs Turbocharges My Writing. And I will not tell you more. You can look at the talk page to see a little bit of a synopsis, but otherwise keep the surprise. So have a good lunch or have a good dinner if you are in uh, dinner friendly times. And I will see you afterwards. Thank you again, Tony. See you. All right, let me just close everything. <laughs> All right, got it. Okay, so thank you so much, Tony. I just had to, to clear everything up on the stream. I'm going to need to... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm going to stop.